Welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to be doing skincare and I'm also going to be doing a 10 day challenge with the skincare. All right, so the skincare brand that I'm going to be trying out for the next 10 days is called Algenis. They are very well known by their name, Algenis. So they have this special algae and it's like a molecule. And then on the outside, there's like these little squiggly lines and it's called algoronic acid. So algoronic acid is supposed to be this wonderful ingredient that boosts every skincare product and you're gonna see results in 10 days. It's pretty much a guarantee, but it's in all of their products and I'm gonna be focusing on three of them today. So the first one I just washed my face with, it's the Gentle Rejuvenating Cleanser, and it says Algenous Algoronic Acid on there. And I do like this. It didn't leave my face tight or anything. It does feel really soft and clean, but not too clean. So I'm gonna be using this cleanser almost every morning but definitely every night for the next 10 days and see if anything goes on because it's in the morning and i just washed my face there was nothing really on my face other than the skincare that i used last night the next thing that i have is the genius liquid collagen but it does have these little tiny beads in it that's supposed to hold the algoronic acid in there and it's supposed to be a vegan collagen. Let's see, so it says, after cleansing and toning, apply to entire face, neck, and decollete, where optimal results follow with moisturizer. So I'm just gonna first take out the syringe. Oh, it's got the little beads all over it. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna squeeze them in there. I'm just going to put this out on the back of my hand and I'm just going to use maybe like two little dollops. So like a pea sized amount. Ooh, it feels so funky. I'm just going to start. Oh, okay. So the beads like dissolve instantly on your skin. Interesting. It doesn't, I can't really smell what it smells like. It's really soft though. It feels really nice on the skin. Wow, and it soaked into my skin pretty well. Like where I put it on my nose, it's already like dried. <laughs> so the third product that I have, I have it in a full size, which if I remember correctly, it's $35, which isn't, bad in my opinion but it's the liquid collagen for your lips and it says twist the green area below the applicator to the left to dispense the pl the product apply directly onto clean dry lips and lip contours maybe use alone or is suggested under balm lipstick or a gloss apply am and pm or as often as desired. So this, I'm probably definitely gonna be using morning and night. So the applicator looks like this. So it says to just twist it to the left. Oh, I'm confused. Oh, oh, are my fingers too slippery? It doesn't look like it twists to the left. What is twisting to the left? Am I twisting to the right or the left? Oh, okay. Still doesn't have any beads. Ooh. Uh, clean, dry lips. Oh. Huh. So this definitely feels like if you ever just carry your moisturizer over across your lips, this is kind of what it feels like. I'm just gonna put a little bit more on and focus it around my lip line. My face is not sticky. It's still quite soft. Like, it's really easy for my skin to really, or my finger to glide over my face. 
Same with my neck, it's not sticky or greasy. All right, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of eye cream and moisturizer on and I'll be right back. I wanted to go over why I wanted to do this 10 day challenge. Um, first and foremost, I want to do this 10 day challenge because I actually want to see if I'm going to see any differences in my skin. I do have before pictures of more up close of my face because I do have Irish and Scottish heritage. So I do have a lot of sun damage to my skin already. I also really like to make expressions and I smile a lot. So I do have pretty deep expression lines already and I don't really believe in Botox so I will not be freezing my muscles. Another thing is my skin gets super super sensitive to certain products. Most products my skin is really good about to where I can handle a lot of things but if I layer too much and I do this like the it just balls off of the, my face. The other thing is I love to drink out of straws so I'm constantly doing that and even my mom she only likes drinking out of straws and she is in her 50s now. Sorry mom <laughs> but she's starting to get those little lines and so um you start losing your collagen in your 20s. So starting skincare in your 20s or when you start hitting puberty and you get acne, in my opinion, is the best. With that being said, I will either film another video of skincare stuff 10 days later to see if there's any progress or I will do a totally separate video. I haven't really decided yet. But I did get this from Fresh Cosmetics, super cute. And I always have to have something with Disney. So I have my tall, dark, and goofy oversized t-shirt on because it's early in the morning and I sleep in this all the time. All right, so it is October 31st. I have my Eeyore onesie on with my little your face and it's got cute little ears on it oh i love you so much all right so um in the beginning part of this video i introduced all of the new skincare that i was going to be using which included the liquid collagen and the cleansers which i don't have it in my bathroom right now but i wanted to come on here and update you on the 10 days and i am so happy with everything I am, I don't even have words to say how impressed I am. Mainly at my lips. My lips are super, super plumbed. All the creasing is pretty much gone on my top lip. My bottom lip, they're fading around the creasing or the curves of my lips right here. It's Oh my gosh, it's so cool. And they're also more plumbed on the top and the bottom here. My lipstick is lasting longer. They're hydrated, ah, everything. And then my forehead is another thing. So I always do this. This one is like the only one that is still really there. All of the other ones, like I don't even feel them anymore. I can see them because I've done that done the facial expression multiple times, but I have I don't even really feel them. The only one that I feel is the biggest one right here. And it's almost gone. Like on the sides right here, it doesn't even feel like anything. And then even my smile lines have been fading out. Oh man. Oh so 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 happy. And then um I went ahead and I dug into my collection of skincare. I found the Algenis Elevate Firming and Lifting Contour Eye Cream and I've used this off and on here and there. I've dug into it pretty a lot and um, I've never consistently used it for 10 days straight and 
doing that has helped a ton with my under eyes because I do get a little creasing right here and also with this line right here is probably the most defined one that I have but my, even my like crow's feet that I get from smiling all the time is it's like gone they're they're not there anymore it's crazy oh my gosh I'm so happy but I also wanted to share um the skincare products that I use along with those four alginous products so the liquid collagen for the face liquid collagen for the lip eye cream and the cleanser I've been using those four things religiously but aside from that I have a couple other products that I've been incorporating into my little 10 day challenge so first thing is the origins maskimizer to help soften my skin and to let the other skincare products absorb more efficiently into my skin and then i also like i said earlier in the video i do have more acne prone pores blackheads i get occasionally oily so i've been using the murad outsmart acne clarifying treatment i've been using this for a few i think two months now so i've been it's obviously a lot slimmer but I really, really like this. It's been keeping a lot of my breakouts. Bay, blackheads are kind of fading out. The main ones are my nose. I don't know how to deal with those. I also use a face mask three times during this 10 day challenge. And I use the Kate Somerville Eradicate Mask, uh, which has foam activated acne treatment with sulfur in it, which helps again with acne, breakouts, pores, blackheads, the whole shabam. And then after I finish with all of my Algenis products, I have been going in with the Dr. Dennis Gross Hyaluronic Moisture Cushion, but it's hot, the Oil Free Moisturizer by Dr. Dennis Gross. Been, I have this in a little sample size and I've been trying to use this up and I've been doing a pretty dang good job about it. I do like this in finishing my skincare. Lastly, I have been using this product for, I want to say maybe six months now, but it's the Grande Lash Lash Enhancing Serum. And I've already went through one kind of travel size and then this is the second one and then I have another one that I gave in and I bought the full size of it uh but this has worked so well on my lashes you can see with this one I never had a problem with my lashes being curly I've always had a problem with them not being long enough or thick enough and this is really helped with everything so with all of those skincare products my skin is at its finest at the moment and i'm super happy about it so if you like this video and if you like skincare please give this video a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe for more videos i post i try to post three times a week uh monday wednesday and friday i do have a new palette video coming out on friday i'm not gonna say what it is yet but it's exciting um, so stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys in the next video and have a great rest of your day.